Anyway, uh, back uh, back on topic, back on back on track. Uh, we had one more Konami game. They were they were putting out some good stuff in 1984, even if they weren't uh, being played that much. But they also made a sports game before there was Double Dribble. There was Super Basketball. Uh, I don't know. Maybe maybe some people saw this. I can't remember seeing it. It might it might have been like kind of successful ish. I don't know. So here's the thing about like arcade sports games. Obviously, okay, if you're making a sports game for like the home market, have we even like looked at a basketball game yet for uh, for push to reject? I can't remember. If you're making like a basketball game for the home market, like you can make like a full like four period game. Obviously, like speed up the action, make the uh, make the timer a little faster so a game is over and like. You can play, like, a full four-period game in, like, 15, 20, 30 minutes or whatever. That doesn't work so well for, for arcade games, because arcade games, they want you to keep putting in money. So you have games like, you know, like, like NBA Jam that make you pay per period, per quarter. So if you want to play, like, a full four-period game, you had to put in either a dollar or two dollars, depending on if it was one token or two tokens per, per period. So I think that left like a lot of developers like with these these early '80s arcade games. They were like tr like struggling to figure out like how do we adapt these games so that like you're not like guaranteed to have like 10, 15 minutes of game time. How do you uh, how do you work it out so? Uh, well, we got some gameplay tips here. How do you work it out so uh, you know? Yeah, you end up with things like the baseball games where. The, the the opposing team gets ahead. Oh, game over. What? <laughs> That's not how baseball works. Anyway, this game has a dribble button. To move your character, you have to be mashing the dribble button to move. I bet that sounds fun already. If you're blocked, you're given two free throws. Uh, reverse the score by shooting long shots. Good timing and pushing and releasing the shoot button is needed for a successful shot. And then you can do a dunk shot. Dribble until directly direct line the basket. Push the shoot button while watching out for opponents blocking. A nice dunk shot. But yeah, getting back to what I'm what I'm talking about. You're gonna see what they what they did with this. What the hell is a ROM name for this, by the way? Super BB? It's not Super BB. Super B ball? S basket? S basket B. I got it on the fourth try. Version I encrypted. How many versions did they make of this? Okay. Substitute. Here we go. Oh, those those crunchy Konami voices. I love it. Dunk shot. Here we go. So I think it's three buttons. Button three is pass. Substitute. Here we go. Here we go. So whoever has the ball magically gets uh, blonde hair. Super basketball. Super basketball. Yeah, they turn Super Saiyan. Grand champ, best five, nobody. Am I supposed to reset that? Is this like track and field? Hold on. Ranking, data remaining, data initialized. Oh, the default high score is 339,000? Jesus Christ. Alright, I'm just gonna speed this up. I went too fast. Here we go. Okay. One, what? Two, three, oh, I'm learning how to count. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Wait, it doesn't go past nine? Why are there two digits if I can't put in more than nine? 
Konami. I can't think of another arcade game that does that where it's counting the credits like that. <laughs> anyway, the way this game works is that... Uh, We've, we've gone ahead in time. I scored 70 points in this game, they have 78. So now you have like a minute to score 8 points to win. And so you get you get extra time if you actually like make a basket. Oh no! <laughs> oh, they blocked the shot. But you don't see them like get the ball. You just like lose 5 seconds and then... You know, you go back to it. So it's kind of like a uh, 10-yard fight, if you've played that. Where, like, you never see the computer on offense, and if they, like, intercept the ball, you just go back, like, 10 yards or whatever. Is the dribble button as bad as I think it is? Uh, it's... I don't know, it's not too hard to, like, reach maximum, like, fire, firing rate, I think, I guess. Also, yeah, I can pass the ball. Oh, he jumps fucking high on the three-point shot. I win a game! He took his shirt off, dude! Dude, you can't do that. Whoa. The next opponent is a high school team. Why is he getting shirt? Oh, whoa. You are great. This bracket's kind of stacked against me. Shameful yank man. Oh! George. I just killed a man! So now I gotta make up 12 points in uh, 50 seconds. Also, I haven't managed to do the, uh, the jump shot yet, huh? Block pass. Block pass! Lose 5 seconds. That was... okay. Yeah, okay. Alright. Yeah, alright. Pretty sure I went under the basket, but whatever. <laughs> I, I'm too afraid to pass, because their defense is really good. The bonuses go up. I guess that makes sense. Okay. Whoa. Huh? What? Oh no. Try it again. Okay. <laughs> okay, I get it now. Just never seen a free throw shot go like twenty feet into the air, but alright. Oh fuck off. Big three! Yeah! Oh, that was a two? Son of a bitch. Win a game. I will win a game. Nice! I want a game! Take your shirt off! <laughs> bravo, 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 bravo. Yeah, 2,000 times whatever. So I guess that's how you get up to 330,000. Call! Get to college team. Oh, bonus stage. What the? <laughs> yeah! Now we're playing basketball. Damn! That was sick. That's like the, the Blades of Steel bonus stage. I can't get the dunk shot off. How close do I have to be? That'd be closer, I guess. Bong. Ow. Oh. That wasn't a block shot, that was a rebound. 
Man, I want to get a, a dunk shot. Man, their defense is tough. They're like all, all fucking up in there. Hmm, I don't think I'm getting past college. Unless I start making some clutch threes. I'm not really sure, like, the best timing to, like, release the shot button. Well, I got five seconds, but... I don't think I have enough time. What? I passed down there. What? All right. You're the boss game. Seven. Ooh, dunk shot! Okay, so you gotta dunk from, like, farther away. But that wasn't close enough? Yeah, I guess that's why the number voice is there, huh? Oh, bullshit. Alright, well... Yeah, you get extra seconds for each shot you make. So you're just constantly, like, trying to put more time on the clock. Uh-oh. I didn't take off time for that one, though. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> that was way too dramatic. Damn. Well, I got... I beat BMW. Mmm. I don't know. I don't have all the... all the strats for this game. I'm gonna reset. Um... I don't know. I kind of feel like I've seen enough. I, I beat a couple teams. Here we go. Like, as far as, like... Oh, wow. Hold on. Here we go. So the high score in Mart for this version is only 356,000, but on the other versions, it's like... On version E, somebody's gotten, like, 6.5 million. <laughs> Oh, this is one of the guys that was cheating, too. Super Final Man Ruler, baby! What's the move? The Ultimo, thank you for the 200 bits. Substitute. Here we go. I don't know, as far as, like... As far as it being, like, an arcade basketball game... Especially one that's, like, you know, so early... Here we go. Here. So early on. Um... It, it's fairly functional. Like, of course, it's kind of weird that they, to uh, to adapt this into uh, into an arcade game, they institute this whole thing where, you know, you have to get time by making baskets to, to win the game. And each game is like a, a bigger and bigger deficit. So wait, 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 hold up, hold up, hold up. So the, the Konami logo on the, on the court in the center... Has the 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 tail, the Kajonami tail, but the tail isn't there on the on the title screen. That's that's weird. <laughs> I don't know. It it's kind of interesting. It kind of works. Kinda. I don't. Oh, no, there it is. Never mind. It must have been Pandora's Palace that didn't have the Kajonami then. I don't know. This, this is not bad. You could definitely... You could definitely do a lot worse. It at least kind of makes sense. 
And like I said, they, uh... It is sort of a way to... To, uh, to challenge the player to... To get farther and farther by having this... This, this goofy time limit thing. And honestly, the dribble button wasn't that bad. You don't have to mash that quickly. Like, I was able to do that just fine on pad. Yeah, I, I kind of think it works better here than it did in 10-yard fight. Not that we're covering 10-yard fight. That game was like... People play 10-yard fight. But yeah, for the time... It's alright. <laughs> alright, what did we wind up with? 60% for three. Damn, a perfect 2-3 split. Well, not, not split, but... Nobody gave votes to anything else. <laughs> no five jokesters, no... Uh, nobody that thought, ah, oh, yeah, it's a four. No, this sucks, it's a one. It's a two or a three. That's that's all you can that's all you can say about this. Mm. Yeah, I mean It's it's okay. I think it's for the time, for nineteen eighty four. It's it's a pretty playable basketball game. That's that's a. Uh... There there are definitely strats to like play this game for a long time, so it's not impossible. Obviously, I don't have the strats, but other people have gotten pretty far. I do wonder if like this version is is like specifically harder. Like earlier versions were way too easy. Because like the the six million score on Mark was like with version E. So maybe. Maybe, like, the the initial versions that were, like, shipped out to arcades, like, <laughs> people got way too good at it. Like, Gauntlet. 